Yo. This life can wither away within the blink of an eye. Whether it was a criminal intent for a piece of the pie or a freak accident on the side of your ride as you drive, never know when the last time you're gonna be alive is what's to be meant for humanity's reality that ages of time goes by. Seeing in the pages of the ages and history of all the slithery snakes that don't let live to take a leave you new dry. Life can permanently leave a tear in your eye. Cause of a fear you unwillingly commandeered as a child. That'll most likely seek with you till you die. But it can also give you an ear to ear smile when positiveness gives you the keys to properly deal with hypocritical mischievousness. Still, though, critics will criticize with a critical hit of his tactic. Seeing how you will react back at them, either with a physical lashing or with still chill, tell with still passion. But the happiness you feel with madness isn't a part of your personality fashion. I think everyone is on the brink, cause no one knows how to just sit still and chill and have a drink. Always compete for a slick kill when it comes to getting the bill fold, feeling itself for greed without the possibility to even know that you're disintegrating your own soul slowly. So don't fold easily when negativity tries to leave you below the surface of the earth's concrete. Just use positivity as defensive weaponry and diffuse hostility by killing with kindness, blinding them indefinitely. Cause no one expects humble hospitality anymore. Just trips to the hospital with situations turn nasty and the outcome is constant blood and gore. All because of a better the two turn to a murderous uproar. And it's so sad that so many moms and dads, the brothers and sisters, the cousins, the knuckles and aunts, gotta constantly mourn who they adore. And it's a shame that a monstrous, heartless entity always these people to create enemies that be asleep with a cruelest intention to rule because they simply want more. Being weak, submit to the demon's feet, just quit it because they bored or they just can't find the L I G H T. And they take shit like acid and hits the G H B. Trip quick, whisking it all for a little mischief to the end of getting a floor shot up in the street. In front of the house with their mom screaming hysterically, as if their blood leaked out of them with enough to get up to the front door, completely covering up the whole vicinity of where they were once for playing hide and go seek. Now for that family, no more galore, holding their loved ones just in abundance of sore remorse. When the end of existence comes too soon for an undeserved, they had a life to live more than what most people take for granted without the advantage of having a pure core. Leaving it unheard of to love and serve with a purpose to worship the Lord and build churches for the cursed who feel they need it coming forth. A redemption and summoning the peace to restore the mangled corpse that used to be my excuse for a life source. When I was a little vicious fight force with a stabbing point. But my point is even though I still glide by with a puff and a snore with a joint, I still have the Lord showing me which door is best entered when good decision becomes what's most important in this world filled with war. Yeah, and that's the message for today. Thank you for the beat, Dr. Dre. Yeah. Thank you.